What do you wish you had known day one that you knew on the last day? That four years goes really fast. It seems like a long time, but uh, it's not, and it goes super quick. Yeah, everyone says that. What do you wish you had known day one that you knew on the last day? Ah, uh, having lived in Macelle Quad freshman year in Baroy, I'd say Sherman Dining Hall is not all it's cracked up to be. It was worth the uphill hike to use in. Although I'm sure you have other dining options now that weren't there when I was there. Those two are still our dining halls. Um, but I live. You have better other options. Than yeah, than yeah. I live in North, so Euston's actually the closest for me. Okay, yeah, you lucked out. Yeah. <laughs> what did you wish you had known day one that you knew today? <laughs> Coach was usually right. <laughs> um, I think, you know especially freshman year, you come in, you think you, you know everything and it's a little bit of a reality check that you, you have to fall in line and you know, follow the, the standards of the team. Um, but even up until senior year, uh, you know, coaches there to put you guys in, and, and us was in our, you know, the best light and the best way to be successful. And uh, she knows what she's doing. So I think I, think I would have uh, probably listened a little more carefully uh, early on. Um, yeah. and trusted that she <laughs> she was doing the right things yeah whenever uh, we say something to Carol or like she mentions an idea and we're like oh that's a good idea she's like ideas are free she yeah. like, <laughs> um, that's very so, true what do you wish you had known on day one that you did know on the last day that my GPA mattered. Um, <laughs> That's a I fantastic one. Yeah, yeah, because I definitely uh, was like, C's get degrees my freshman <laughs> year, uh, which was so stupid. Uh, C's do get degrees, but they don't get you good jobs uh, when you graduate because your GPA matters when you graduate. <laughs> No, that's honestly the best answer like I've heard. Seriously. Yeah. Yeah. No, I, um, I mean, it all, it all worked out. Like I have a great job. I love my job, like all that stuff. And I like had a job when I was leaving school and you know, that's all good and well, but do I think that if I had like cared uh, my freshman year that I would have had like a higher GPA and like probably had maybe better career opportunities right off the bat? Um, definitely. So um, sorry, mom and dad, they would like literally be rolling in their grave. Well, they know this, but, um, yeah, it was just really stupid. Really stupid. What did you wish you had known day one that you knew on the last day? Hard one. Um, probably how fast it goes. Like, you know, four years goes in like the blink of an eye and then you're just like, wow, how I need to figure out what I want to do with my life now and get a, like a real job and <laughs> American studies don't know like what what is that even a major in um so that that was definitely like a kick in the butt on the last day I like, go oh, that went fast so <laughs> enjoy it <laughs> I feel like I blinked I'm, uh, I'm already a junior yeah. it goes yeah and then you're just like geez like how did because the seasons I feel like it seems so long you know like mm -hmm. the day-to-day -day practice and then you blink and you're like oh man done <laughs> so yeah enjoy it what do you wish you had known day one that you knew on the last day oh definitely just try everything from day one like I feel like it took me yeah. a year or two just to kind of like go to certain events like every year I'd be like oh like maybe I'll do that next year or seeing that right. someone on the team had fun on it or at like going to it like I feel like it took me a little bit too late to kind of get more involved, but I loved everything that we did. And I feel like our team was pretty good about like going to different campus events or activities. Oh yeah. Trivia night, everything. Like we had so much fun going to those as a team. So I wish that I, what I, how much I did senior year, I did that freshman year. Yeah. Same. I wish day one I had known that senior year there was going to be a pandemic and I would have done a lot more stuff. Yeah. But <laughs> what do you wish you knew uh day one that you did know the last day that I didn't know the last day or that you did not wait <laughs> <laughs> that you wish you had known like the first day but you didn't know uh no <laughs> you wish you had learned the first day but you knew the last day <laughs> um 
I mean, I guess you know it at the time, but it's like something that's always on the back burner, but it's to like, just really enjoy playing basketball competitively, like where it means something. Because for me, uh, my senior year, we didn't, we had made the NCAA tournament, you know, the previous three years. And so I think we kind of expected to make it uh, my senior year and we didn't. So I literally, we were waiting for the bids to come out. I had got home from class and I thought, okay, I'll come out. Well, I'll have to go to practice at three. I woke up and Shape, Casey and Diana, who were the three girls I live with all on the team in Ridgewood. They were like, have, I shouldn't say this, but they were having some drinks on the, on the counter. And I'm like, don't we have practice? And they're like, no, we didn't make it. And so it's just that like, things are finite. Your time playing basketball, at least like in a competitive sense is very finite. So enjoy every moment that you can. Mm -hmm. All right. <laughs> what do you wish you had known day one that you did know on the last day? So what, what I wish I had known more um, that I guess in retrospect, I'm like, I just can't believe how fast it went by. Like it just flew. And now I'm like, it was 30 years ago, like, which is unbelievable. But when you're there, it's like, that is your life. And like you, you're in it. But can you believe you're a senior right now? I, I can't believe it. And especially like with like the COVID situation and everything, we don't even know what's going to happen. So like, that's something that we even kind of talked to our freshmen about this year. Like, it's not even like guaranteed that four years that you have, because that's something we realized like, okay, like we have freshmen through senior year. Well, I don't, we don't even know if we're going to get senior year. Like it's kind of up in the air right now. So it's just like, definitely making the most of every single second you have, because it's like not guaranteed. So. And in college, like you're with your friends all the time. Mm -hmm. And then like when you graduate, everybody kind of goes and does their own thing. And it's like, wait, I miss everyone, you know? Yeah. Yeah. So it's you like you, kind of, yeah, you get um, sort of in the routine, you start to understand everything. And then you're basically forced to retire. Mm -hmm. It's like, wait, but now, you know, I, I <laughs> Right. It's like, nope, sorry, see you later. Just, I think, um, go ahead. I, I was going to say, um, yeah, like a gratitude thing. I think um, I wasn't ungrateful, but I think I would have put more emphasis on being lucky to be there, mm -hmm. you know, being lucky to have the opportunity to practice, to, right. you know, I mean, last in incurred an injury and you know, I would never, you know, Lara would have given anything to not have that injury and been able to do sprints and, you know, it's, I, I think, um, yeah, just being grateful every second because, mm -hmm. you know, you never know. Right. Definitely. What do you wish you had known day one that you knew on the last day? Mm. Um, that everything is going to be okay. You know, it's, it's, Everything is new when you're walking into uh, college, first day, leaving home. Like I didn't, I didn't do anything like that growing up, and you had a lot of worry and stress about it. And in the end, it was it's gonna be okay. It's gonna be great, and um, it was it was great. What do you wish you had known day one that you knew on the last day, Brandeis? Some of these questions are tough. I read them over. <laughs> <and> I'm, like, <laughs> I'm like, I'm going to just see what happens when I, tomorrow. Um, and here I am still without an answer. Um, I just, I guess I wish that I would have felt more comfortable with everybody right away. You know, like I was <clears throat> trying to fit in too much, you know, like trying to seem cool or whatever, but like once I got to know everybody, like everybody was weird, but we all loved each other anyway. So I'm like, I wish I could have just been myself from the beginning. <clears throat> and I mean, it, did, it didn't take that long once, you know, we spent every minute together, but I guess that's what I would have changed. What do you wish you had known day one that you knew on the last day of your college experience? Uh, I could probably have studied a little harder. <laughs> 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 you 
you know, uh, I'm trying to think what would I have changed, you know, I try, would I have changed anything that I did? I, I'm so glad I played basketball because it really gave me that outlet. Yeah. Um, I guess one of my regrets is not going, uh, doing a junior year abroad. One of my basketball buddies who became one of my best friends and we traveled in Europe together, she did her junior year abroad in England. And I, I, I guess, you know, maybe because I was a scholarship kid, I didn't know if I could afford it. Yeah. So, but one semester, I think I could have, you know. So yeah. that was maybe one thing, but I ended up going to Europe anyway. So didn't yeah. matter. So. <laughs> What do you wish you had known day one that you knew on the last day? This question is oh, really hard. <laughs> I don't know. It, it was, I don't know. <laughs> I guess just trying to like maximize your, like find a good balance of fun, working hard in school, whether in like your internships or in different jobs and on the team, but make sure you have fun and you're just like focusing on building relationships around you. It's always the key, not just at Brandeis, but just in general, relationships are, are the key to everything. Yeah. 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 I, I just felt like, I mean, I had a great time in high school and I was going, and I came from a great family. I was going to great college and I just really, really enjoy, you know, just enjoyed everything. <laughs> it, it just, um, I can't, I can't put down one thing or, or you know, yeah, I just, it, it just, it just was, it was excellent, you know? Yeah. What do you wish you had known day one that you knew on the last day? I am more capable than I thought I was. <laughs> I feel that more and more every day, I think. I, I just think, um, I don't know, when you come from a small place, things are easy for you. And then you, I went to Brandeis and things were not easy for me. And I think I had a real difficult time, shook my confidence. But now coming back as an adult, I realized that that was a formative experience. I wish I could go back and tell myself then, look, you are capable of doing this. <laughs> you are capable of of um, succeeding at Brandeis, even though it's a really um, challenging school and highly respected school. And um, even though you came from nothing, basically, that doesn't mean anything. Yeah. I like that. 